What's up everyone? So recently I have passed the CKA exam and this will be a short video to share my experience on stuff that um, maybe can help you pass the certified Kubernetes administrator exam. So let's get started. Okay, first you have to be quick typing commands during the exam. And the only areas that you will need is that one. Trust me on this. Don't spend too much time configuring aliases. You will be losing precious time. Okay, second, using a real environment to prepare for the exam. So when I was preparing for the CKA exam, I thought that it will be very um, interesting if I can build the cluster from scratch and then automate that using Vagrant. With this environment, you can do all the labs you want. You can break stuff for the troubleshooting section. And with one command, you can start with a fresh environment. So I ended up building AutoCube, um, which can help you do that. It's based on the latest uh, Kubernetes uh, version with container D as a runtime and Calico as a CNI. So next, so this is the obvious things, but you have to practice a lot. And one way of doing this is to use the tutorials section from Kubernetes documentation to practice. So the last thing is recommended, but optional. But if you want to deep dive on cluster setup, you can use Kubernetes the hard way. You will get more knowledge on different components on the cluster and how they interact with each other. Okay, so overall, I think that the exam complexity is fair for an admin level. And if you are managing a Kubernetes cluster on a daily basis, the exam is um, will be kind of easy for you. All right, so good luck with your Kubernetes CKA exam. And if you did find this video useful, please hit that like button. See you on the next video.